Okay, so we're back in Panama, and actually we're going to be staying at Anchor tonight, overnight, in the Gaton Lake Anchorage. So what I'm going to do now is take you down and show you an anchoring operation. Okay, so we're down here on the forward mooring. Just walk back the anchor to the water level. Let me show you. So you can see the anchor is now lowered to the water level. We don't normally have this many officers here on the station, but everybody's on familiarization and learning, so and I came down to make a vlog because I can't do it whilst I'm actually doing it. So this is our wonderful person. Hello. <laughs> From Portugal. Now he's the guy that operates the windlass itself for the anchor. I'll show you our anchor. This is our port side anchor. This is our anchor windlass. We have one windlass at each anchor, port side, starboard side. This is where we control it from. In this case, the boatswain is controlling it because the officer actually gives the order, which is not me, it's Christian who has the charge here at the moment. Hello, everyone! <laughs> this is our manual brake, so if we do need to release it in an emergency, this is how we do it. And yeah, it's quite a relatively simple operation. We engage it into a gear to walk it back slowly at our own pace. Or we drop on the brake if we want to walk it back, it back a bit faster. Let's fall over then. So first the anchors walk back to the water level as it is now, and then what they do is the bridge gives the order on the radio to drop the anchor um, to the seabed. So normally we go to two on deck or two in the water, depending on the depth. Uh, the bridge will give that order, then Christian will give the order to the bosun, and they're going to drop the anchor. <laughs> So basically what the bridge wants to know is how many shackles we have paid out, so in the water or on deck. As you can see the, the shackles are marked by the white painted links and then the red painted uh, control link. Um, so you can see in that one, they're not they're painted, and obviously all the chain is kept in the chain locker so they get a bit worn down, so it's not as clear to see. Uh, so you have to have a sharp eye. And what they're doing now is they're thrusting the bow around, get some weight on that chain, make sure the flukes dig in into the anchor so we get a good hold, and then we're gonna pay out more, more cable each time we wanna pay out. The officer waits till the weight comes on, then he pays out more, gives the order to the bosun. Now it looks like it's reducing a little bit. Yeah. The fox are bridge. Now five in the water and hold. Five in the water and don't post. Put the ship brought up now to a port anchor, five in the water. Really like this. Brought up means it's an equilibrium between the weight and the wind effects and everything on the ship itself and the weight on the cable. So really what's holding us in place more than the anchor itself is the cable and the weight of that cable in the water. The short to medium weight. And this is usually when the ship's brought up to our anchor, at which point the officer reports to the bridge. And that's it. We got everything. That's the Island Princess brought up in the Panama Canal, Gatton Lake Anchorage, brought up to a fourth anchor, five in the water. Thanks for watching guys, hope you learned something new about life at sea and if you did enjoy it then please hit that subscribe button, hit that little bell next to it if you want to get notifications every time I upload something and we'll move forward from here, please don't forget to comment and let me know what you want to see from me, I'm looking forward to it.